this is no longer an exhibition. This is no longer kind of a novel thing that guys do after batting practice on the workout day. This is big business. The eight combatants are on the field. A little going, going on. It's time for the Derby. There it is. What a over show. Out. And the crowd and the players all wow. standing here on the first wow, baseline. 20. 21, the most in this format in the first round, had been Stanton with 16, Pete. That's, that's an unbelievable number. Yes. There is Vlad Guerrero Jr. You know the name because most people that know baseball know the dad. You're going to see some amazing things tonight, but this guy... If I could watch one player hit batting practice for the next 15 years, this is at 20 years old, oh my God. And he's hitting moonshots. It's 29, he breaks the home run derby record for home runs in a round, which I never thought we'd see it. Ronald Cunha Jr.'s got a nice sweet swing. He's already got that launch angle built in. All he's got to do is touch it from there. He's on a nice pace, man. I think he's going to get over 20, and if he continues to hit middle in, Acuna's going to hit a lot of home runs in this second half of the round. Ronald Acuna Jr., boy, like Peterson and Guerrero, how about it? The polar bear, my guy, hits it harder than anyone in this contest. He hasn't really hit his groove here, but you see these home runs to center field. Once he does, I don't think 13 is going to be a problem at all. That ball just went over the trees yeah. in center field. Yep. Alonzo just hit his 13th here. All he needs is one more to move on, and he doesn't even have the 30-second bonus. There it is. There it is. He doesn't he even knows need it. the 30-second bonus. <laughs> he knows it. Well done. It's gone. Vlad Guerrero Jr. off a round in which he hit 29 home runs. He was born to hit home runs. Yes. These yeah. are massive shots. And the crowd is on its feet. They know they're seeing something special. Back-to-back -back rounds of 29 home runs for Vlad Guerrero Jr. My God. This is getting exciting. Doc's in a groove right now. That ball up and in. He is climbing the mountain. It's, it is complete adrenaline at the end of these rounds, no matter what you're doing. And they are shocked over there with Vlad Guerrero Jr.'s 29. 29! 29. He's tied. He looks over to the Guerrero side. That may do it. He hits 30 in the round to beat him. They're off on the, the main scoreboard. He finished with 29. Now they just fixed it on the scoreboard. So we tied here, Carl. 29's the number. We're going to have our first one-minute playoff. Started with 29. There goes another one. So he's got 36 in this round with six on the clock. There's another one. we got 37 on our board here. That's what Jock Peterson will shoot for in 60 seconds. Jock's going to do it. Watch him. That's 36. Needs one more. This has to get out. He got it. Last one had to go, and look at how close it was. <laughs> that last one barely got out. This is something we haven't seen before. A swing off. Three swings per batter. There's one for one. I don't know. I don't if that's going to get there to center. No, All right. He's got All one. Right. I believe Jock Peterson now has the advantage of knowing what he needs to get. There's one. So at the very least, we'll... Have another swing off. Needs is one more. This would be a walk off. Oh, he pulled out. That's foul. Do it again. Incredible show these two are putting on. What a show. Oh, there's one. coming back. No, it's not. Y 39, 38. Y viene el último swing. Lo tiene. El jonrón de diamante. El número 40. This guy has it. Yes, he does. And he looks over at Jock, who will not make eye contact. Now he needs two. And you're like, I've got to watch Jock do this. I was excited, but I mean, listen to her. She's saying, let's go, Jock. Let's go, Jock. And there's one. Here we go. After one swing. Here we go. Oh! oh! What a valiant fight by Jock Peterson. And what a show we've never seen. A swing off, let alone two of them. Zacunia's so checked out. He's done. He's he was exhausted. Out. He was exhausted. 19 home runs. A great round. So let's see what Alonzo can do and see if he can get him a little better roll than he did the first round. Pete Alonzo hits the ball to center field better than anybody in Major League Baseball. Moonshots out.
straight away. Well, there's a long one here. He's already got his uh, 30 seconds of extra bonus time, and he's starting to climb towards that 19. No reason to panic here for Pete Alonso. Oh, big fly here. This should be number 16, and he is right on the heels of Acuna. He wants one more. He doesn't want the 30-second bonus. He wants to beat it right here. Look at him. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love this kid. Pete Alonso and the man he says is like his brother are going to the finals. He almost puts you to sleep his first two minutes, and then he goes out and gets on an absolute tear. Dad won this thing in 2007. Vlad Guerrero as a rookie trying to win this thing in his first try. But when Vlad Jr. gets on a roll, it's such a beautiful thing to watch. I mean, he takes a pretty round of batting practice when he's on a roll, and he's gotten on a few of them already today. A very different looking round for Junior. There's no doubt, and we've seen it in a lot of home run derbies in the past where the last round, guys are not hitting as many home runs. That's where the big, strong guys that can miss balls, like both of these guys have an advantage. So I, I just don't think that they're both going to be tired. But let's see if Vlad Jr.'s 69 home runs in the first two rounds catch up to him. 22, and that one would be 23. No. I didn't get out. 22. That's a good number. It's a great number. It seems like it's a reachable number. I think we have drama here. Well, Pete Alonso came into this event. He said it was a bucketless moment for his career. He had a plan with his cousin. He was going to map out exactly what they were going to do. And now he's here. All he's got to do is hit 23. I say all he's got to do. Right. But with the amount of home runs we've seen hit and, and how he's starting this round, it can easily happen. Sure can. Pete Alonso, who leads the National League as far as rookies go in every single category. You talk about an amazing first half of the season. I mean, it's not for Yelich and Bellinger. We'd be talking about a leading candidate yes. for the MVP in his rookie year in City Field, which is not a hitter's park traditionally. 15 home runs, needs seven to tie for 58. Oh, my goodness. He's got his bonus time. He's looking good right he's now. He's got 18 oh. home yep. runs. And there's his timeout. He is in such a good Woo. position right now. A minute two remaining. He's got his bonus. Look at him playing he the crowd. Knows, he knows he's in a good spot right here. 29 seconds to hit two. That was a line drive off the top of the wall. There it One is. More. Pete Go Alonso on. fires the bat up. He's your home run derby champion of 2019. He didn't even need the 30-second bonus. He How impressive flip. was that? What a show we saw tonight. Vlad Jr. and Alonzo, what a re respect right there. Nothing but love. That was fun.